Okay, guys. <clears throat> I thought I'd make a or make a video about uh, pets during the shit hit the fan scenario. No, I just got out of work and uh, thought about that on the way home. Anyway, let's say you uh, you have a dog or something. Cat, dog, something that wanders around in the yard. And if you have a big dog or something, it'd be an advantage as far as uh, security. You know, the dog's going to notice people coming into, your, into the yard before you do. Be sure as hell going to alert you to anybody around the yard. Um, but something else to think about. When you look at um, collapses in the past, look at like after World War II and these, you know, all these European countries just totally devastated. Man, people's pets would disappear, and they wind up in, on some family's dinner table. So that's just something to think about. How are you gonna deal with that? I mean, I guess, you know, obviously, if you have a pet, you know, it'd be a good idea to put some food aside for the for the cat or dog or whatever you have as well. You know, don't forget to, obviously, Spot's got to eat as well. But another thing, you know, if you have just one dog, I wonder, maybe if you have a couple dogs, you have some land out there and two, three dogs, I guess they can help defend each other. But one dog in the past, man. That's been somebody's dinner. So, two sides of the coin there, man. One side, you know, you've got some, another member of your family in many cases. Someone to keep an eye on the yard, you know. Probably would just eat a lot of scraps in that kind of scenario, if need be. You know, if you have kids, dog would keep the kids entertained while you do whatever you gotta do. And keep an eye on the kid at the same time. And anybody comes around, alert you. But also, you know, oh, Fido can just disappear one night. So you probably got to keep him. I don't know if you want to keep him indoors, where you you know that's not going to happen, or outdoors to keep an eye on things. But he, you know, he might disappear. I don't know. Anyway, I just wanted y'all's thoughts on this because again, if you look at. Uh, Post World War II, all the devastation, all the famine, people would not eat their own pets. But the neighbor's pet, hey, that's fair game. And that, you know, their pets disappeared. So, what do y'all think about that? What do y'all think is going to happen? What do you think you should do? Like, let's just say you have a dog. Keep the dog inside. And maybe if somebody breaks into the house, you know, they, they, the dog can attack them at night. And, still protect you or do you keep them outside so you got some time to get yourself ready um, you know grab a gun or something I don't know probably a good idea to keep a gun next to you but you know you never know so anyway let me know y'all's thoughts I just uh, I thought about that on the way here figured I'd make a video about it